This video was created for genetics class, summer 2013, for the CSUMB nursing program. It was created by Jessica Dubois and by Lindsay Pavlovich. The topic of this video is alcaptinuria, signs, symptoms, and causes. Alcaptinuria is defined as an inherited condition that causes urine to turn black when exposed to air. It's a rare autosomal recessive disorder that's found in one in every 250,000 live births in the United States. Alcaptinuria is caused by a defect in the HGD gene. A genetic defect creates the inability for the body to properly break down certain amino acids. One example of an amino acid is tyrosine. When tyrosine is not broken down properly, it causes a buildup of homogentistic acid. This acid is then stored in the skin and in other connective tissues of the body. The only way to rid the body of excess homogentistic acid is through urine. When the urine is excreted from the body, air mixes with it and it begins to take on a black color. Also associated with alcaptinuria is a buildup of dark pigmentation in the connective tissue, such as cartilage and in the skin. This pigmentation has a tendency to be blue or black in color and usually appears after age 30. This discoloration is most commonly found in the whites of the eyes as well as the ears, and it's referred to as ochronosis. Alcaptinuria is a genetic autosomal recessive disorder that's passed down from parents to their offspring. Two copies of the abnormal HGD gene must be present in order for the disease to develop. People with only one defective gene in a pair are considered carriers. However, they can still pass this abnormal gene on to their children. There is a high prevalence of alcaptinuria in Slovakia as well as in the Dominican Republic. It's estimated that in Slovakia, the prevalence of alcaptinuria is 1 in 19,000 people. Alcaptinuria affects a person's joints, connective tissue, and urine. Joints are affected most often between the ages of 30 and 40. Major joints such as knees, hips, shoulders, and spine are most commonly affected by this disorder. 50% of people who have alcaptinuria will require at least one joint replacement by the age of 55 years old. Arthritis usually begins in the spine and is characterized by flattening and calcification of the invertebral discs. Also, persons with alcaptinuria tend to have a thickened Achilles tendon, tendinitis, or a complete rupture of the tendon. If you have any further questions, please visit the government website genetics home reference or www.akusociety.org. If you have any signs or symptoms of alcaptinuria, please consult a physician. Thank you for watching.